Hey what's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to unbox and set up the Midnight Black face plates for the PlayStation 5. I previously owned the Dark Plates from D Brand, but I decided to paint them in order to make a future video on a Mandalorian themed desk setup video. So that put me in a spot where I needed black face plates again, so that's why I decided to pick up the official black plates from Sony. The PS5 face covers retail for $70 Canadian and $55 in the United States. The package Packaging follows the same design as the rest of the PlayStation 5 products with the white and blue as well as the product image. I really like the simple design they went with, but now let's go ahead and unbox it. So inside you get your paperwork and you get the black faceplates of course. There's not much to the whole unboxing experience, it's pretty straightforward. The plates themselves are made out of plastic and are the exact same as the ones that came with the launch edition PlayStation 5, but these are obviously just in a different color. Sony did choose to keep the PlayStation icons engraved into the inner part of the plates which is an awesome design detail that I really really like. Sony definitely could have cheaped out and just made cheap plastic smooth covers, but I'm glad that they went that extra mile and put those little icons on the inner side. Now to put on the plates it's pretty easy all you have to do is lay the console down on its side and gently lift the top corner and slide the plate down and it will pop right off. You gotta do the exact same thing for both sides then you're ready to install the new plates. Everything is on a hinge system so you just have to slide it right onto the opening and then push. Once you press down gently they will lock into place and you'll hear a little snap sound. The whole process is super simple and to be honest it kind of feels like you're a chiropractor Practor making an adjustment on your patient or something. So now that the face covers are on, you can see just how gorgeous the PlayStation 5 looks in black. It gives a really cool stealth aesthetic to the PlayStation 5 and it won't stand out as much compared to the standard white plates. The PlayStation 5 with the Midnight Black covers pairs really well with the Midnight Black DualSense controller. I know that was pretty obvious, but going from an all-white PlayStation 5 with the white controller and just seeing it in black is just mind-blowing. The first time I saw it, I was like, damn, this thing looks really good and having the console and the controller in black together is a must if you want a darker themed desk setup. Personally I think I'm going to make a Batman themed desk setup in the near future with my Batman gaming chair and then the black PS5 and everything and it just looks really really cool. Now overall I really like the midnight black faceplates for the PlayStation 5 but I do still think they're really overpriced for what they are and I think they should be priced around the 40 to 50 dollar mark and not 70 Canadian dollars I think that's a bit much but they are definitely going to revamp the overall aesthetic of the console and I think it looks really really good. Now if you're someone who's debating which faceplate cover to get for your PlayStation 5, I think the black is probably the safest option and you can always swap back to the original white plates if you don't want to use the black. Or you can always get some of the other color options like the blue, the purple, the cosmic red. There's a ton to choose from but personally I think the black is the best. Right now I currently own the white, midnight black, and cosmic red faceplate. Plates. To be honest, I really like all of them, but the black is just a classic color for a console and I really, really like it. And if you guys want to pick up some midnight black face covers for your own PlayStation 5, I'll leave a link down below in the description. I think having maybe one set of alternate face plates is a must for most PlayStation 5 owners. It's just nice to swap out the colors and revamp the whole setup. But yeah, guys, that is the midnight black face covers for the PlayStation 5. Leave a comment down below of what you guys think about them because personally, I really Really, really like them. Like I said, they are a bit overpriced, but if you're only going to buy maybe one alternate pair for your PlayStation 5, it's not too, too bad. Also, if you guys are interested in seeing that Mandalorian desk setup, make sure you subscribe because I'm probably going to post it sometime this month and it is going to be epic. There's going to be a lot of Mandalorian themed collectibles and everything. I have a dark saber. The whole setup is just going to look really, really cool, especially with the chrome PlayStation covers that I painted myself. It looks pretty close to best guard and I just can't wait to show you guys what this desk setup is going to look like. So like I said, stay tuned for that one. But this is the end of this video. Thank you again for watching. I hope you guys all have a great day and I will see you guys in the next video.